Welcome to five in the morning because we're going on a surf trip with my friend Fraser Which I don't think you guys met yet and the other day he messaged me saying that the waves were gonna be pretty good Wave good Okay His good is a lot better than my good. I think his good is like very big my goods like very small and nice. But he said the waves are gonna be good, so I guess I'm believing him. And even if they are massive and I get pounded, drill. <laughs> we'll be out of film freezer. I believe the journey that we're doing today is around four or so hours. So we're gonna drive all the way up north and then we're gonna camp the night and then we're gonna drive all the way back down. It should be interesting, should be a fun experience. I don't think I've ever actually seen really good waves with my eyes. So this is gonna be a new experience. Boom. Love, we know it's real, don't pretend. Can't keep up with you, try and talk to you, but it's tense. Oh, this guy's a battle arena on the back of his car. I have arrived at the agreed upon meeting spot, but there is no sign of Fraser. And there is a good reason for this. Meet 6.30. Okay. And right now it is currently 6.10. Yeah, I guess I... Uh, on maps it says it takes an hour and I left at 5.30. I guess I must have hit a time warp or something. Oh! Oh! Bunny! 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 Bye bye! But I have been in this location before, oh yes. A while ago I used to play soccer. And I remember specifically coming to this soccer field right here. And we were playing the lowest ranked team in the whole soccer league. And we thought we were going to win very easily, and we got destroyed! You underestimate my power! And then we became the lowest team in the whole soccer league. Mm -hmm. Wow, look at that sunrise over there. It's so beautiful. Uh -huh. Hello! Morning. <laughs> This is Fraser. Fraser surf good, yes. Tell me what I would have done before. Now I let what ever happened to me. Blue old and headstrong, but that's just a ploy. Oh, that looks so sick! Damn! Okay, now this is epic. Epic surf. Hey, look at it. Fraser doesn't think it's that epic because it's not that big. But for me, it looks pretty perfect. <laughs> we are stuck. Yeah, there's one out. Probably good, yeah. I'll have a look. Hang on. Forward a bit, forward a bit. Alright, ready? Go! Hey! Yes! Yes! Freedom! Freedom! It's gonna be a real tight now. Yeah. <laughs> We've been saved by we the nice locals. Up, yeah. <laughs> so it turns out that the mighty CRV doesn't like to go backwards. <laughs> Never mind. Turns out the mighty handbrake was down <laughs> the whole time. We messed up. Dude, this is gnarly. The CRV is munching it. Hey, there's no one out here. All right, Fraser's about to go out there and he's gonna do some surfing on the waves. Try to. Yeah. All right. <laughs> Yeah. 
monkey's ten feet tall that's frightened the bear. How long do you think this guy will survive in the water? When everyone else is wearing wetsuits, this is how you know that you're a maniac. Absolute mad lad. Brother. We're now at a campground. That last little surf session, I didn't really catch anything apart from that one little wave, but I promise that one day I will catch a wave on film that will be semi-decent. Earlier in the day, I caught a couple and they felt really good. There was one I dropped in, I like did hex, as you can say. And I'm not lying, because Fraser was there and he saw it. Yeah. But one day, we'll get one of those on film, and you'll realize that I'm not lying about being able to stand up on a surfboard. But as for now, we're unpacking the car because we're at a campground, and we have to set up tents and stuff. Look at us. Look at how cool we look with our surfboards on the ground. Oh, there, there's a sleeping bag! Unlike the last surf trip, we have a tent, but we also have poles. Because on the last one that we filmed, there were no poles, and we ended up having to do a very sketchy looking job. Look at that! Much more successful than our last tent. Our tent is bigger than everybody else's. Small tent, small tent, small. Twelve o'clock midnight. <laughs> All ready to go to sleep and wake up in the morning. Go surf some more. Go get freaking shacked. And here I am in my sleeping bag, ready for sleep. And there is Fraser and his sleeping bag ready to go to sleep. I'm going to turn this light off and I'll see you in the morning. Oh, right. <laughs> it's the sound of nature. I slept pretty good last night. It's now it's time to, time to head off. We head down to the beach, go do some more surfing. You can hear the waves from the campground. I didn't realize we were this close to the water, which means I think they're bigger than I think they were gonna be. No matter, we will head down to the beach and we will check it out. Yeah, that's pretty sick. Camping's pretty fun. <sighs> Good morning, world. It says a little funny. <laughs> looking perfect, mate. Oh, it's looking, looking good. Oh, would you look at that? Wow. This place is glorious. Very nice. Snakes showing no remorse, looking for their dark horse, wearing peacock, wears always his crocodile tears. Night I'll see your nightmares, but as for daily fears, swear the ones who see all men there, the flies on the wall.
I know probably hardly any of you probably knew this, but Cade likes boys. Yeah, okay. Fraser's going to go out there. He's going to go do some surfing. He's going to go do some backflips. Go! Yes! Yeah, boy! <laughs> 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 and that's the end of me and Fraser's little surf trip to Shipwreck Bay. It was really sick. I didn't really manage to catch heaps of waves. In those clips, you can tell that I am struggling. That was pretty much my second time riding on the west coast of New Zealand. And if you didn't know, the west coast is much gnarlier than the east coast. Currents are just crazy, and like the waves are just so much more powerful, and my little east coast arms couldn't handle that. But we will get to the point where we can freaking shred the west coast and it's going to be sick. Really sick couple days in the water. Doesn't matter if we caught anything because we had a good time anyway and that's really all that matters. And yeah, hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you guys want to go check out Fraser's Instagram, it's right here. You can go check out his cool like surfing stuff. I hardly ever plug this, but if you haven't and you're wondering, make sure to go check out my merch store if you want to and go pick up something. This shirt's in there, you know, it's probably my favorite one. The love the world one. Very cool, very swag. Very cool, very swag. I like it. But yeah, that's just for all the comments that are like, yo, do you have merch? And I'm like, yeah, I do have merch. In fact, link is in the description. But if you don't care about that, I will see you guys in the next video. Thank you guys so much for watching. And yeah, make sure to stay hydrated. I love my oh, make sure to subscribe. <laughs> It'll take five days by car But we don't know where to go And I don't know if you know Or I don't know if you see But baby why
what's going on.